for a special Buzz Builder edition of Watch Me Wednesday. So if you took even two weeks off your Facebook or Twitter account, you would have missed the entire story of the new Gap logo. Gap has had the same logo since Gap started. Um, it's just been a big blue box with the word Gap in the middle, very iconic, very recognizable. And just last Monday, on October 4th, they decided to change their logo and they released the new one, which was just the word Gap with a little blue box above the P. So kind of the same feel, but just different enough to make the fans upset. They received over 2,000 negative comments on their Facebook page. People tweeted left and right about how they couldn't understand why the company made such a big decision to just change their logo. There was a contest held online to see if someone could design the new logo, but none of those were chosen, and the company just did what they wanted. So it goes to show you that Gap listened to their tweets, they listened to their Facebook page, and they changed back to the old logo not even two weeks later. They said that the logo was supposed to be part of their holiday marketing, but I guess they decided that listening to their fans was a bigger, uh, bigger deal and more important to them. So do you think that Gap did the right decision? Would you have listened to your fans?